ladies and gentlemen welcome back to another video so we are continuing our journey through the battle pass uh today we are going to be using the makeshift striker 9 blueprint um and so these are actually a couple of them i'm going to make a couple of videos on these different blueprints but this one you get the operator skin vial black cell um and so we're just going to focus now on tiers where you can unlock weapons pretty easily so this one i only had to use one tier last time uh we tried out the new weapons so we used up about 15 total tiers of our tier skips we had left from our black cell and then we also have this one which we can do right away because it's connected to that other one so we could get two weapons for the price of one uh, and then from there we could probably move our way over to the beginning area here and kind of go through different weapons as well uh so we're just going to try to be as efficient as we can be with these battle pass tokens uh but with that said we do have a new weapon to try out so let's go ahead and make a class and check out this blueprint all right striker nine there we go striker nine and then it is the makeshift so it looks like they <laughs> made it into kind of like a beat up weapon left over the attachments it comes with is the monolith uh, monolithic suppressor for undetectable by radar those recoil control at the cost of ads speed and aim walking speed the striker elite long barrel for bullet velocity aiming at all sway recoil control damage range at the cost of hip fire and tax uh, stance spread movement speed aim walking speed sprint to fire speed and then it's using the cronin int at inlet in int less msp12 uh we'll check it out if we don't like it we'll swap it out um but this one i think does it have a negative on it it, yeah, it looks like it does uh ads speed and aim walking speed so we can add a couple of attachments first thing i'm going to do i'm going to add a little bit of a bigger mag just because i like having more ammo um and then we're going to try to see if we can get something that increases our sprint to fire speed without really affecting our um other stuff so maybe just like yeah like this one would be a decent one for idle sway fire aiming stability gun kick control might be a little bit of a negative but it'll kind of help out with the movement speed sprint speed and walking speed ah, i kind of want my ads speed to be a little bit quicker so i'm gonna say no to that one let's see if we can get maybe the rear grip has something we can use um no uh what about the under barrel okay this is a this, yeah this is a decent one right here i don't just make my tax spread a little bit garbage <laughs> um so with that said we could put a camo on here if we wanted um i kind of want to see what it looks like just by itself so we'll go ahead and rock it by itself and then we'll move on from there so there it is fully kitted out let's drop in let's see if it's good all right that's what it looks like pretty beat up let's see how it performs There's always one guy that I miss out on. GG's. <laughs> ran out of ammo brother dang i gotta oh yeah ow Nah! Why am I being surrounded by these guys? You know, see if I can try to play the objective because I'm trying to complete this other uh, XP event. And that's just not going to happen unless I'm actually, you know, in the uh, hard point or whatever. No, get him!
There's a lot of zombies in the hard point. Oh, the drop shot on me. That was clean. That was a clean drop shot. All the zombies here, you just got if you find yourself constantly reloading on this thing. Just trying to figure out where the next hard point is. All right, here we go. Got it. It's just a, it's a bad move when I'm trying to get any kind of range on people with this thing. But it feels like it does kill pretty quick. So it, it's feeling... It's feeling pretty, pretty good. All right. Oh, wow. My boy's proned out on the ground. <laughs> Gotta help out my squad, bruh. I can even freaking find this thing. Oh, my aim is booty right now. Oh, yo, this thing, like, melts pretty easily. Holy hell. There's one guy around this side. Two of them, actually. Hiding in the water. Yeah, one guy here. Maybe we went into him. Oh! Oh, bro, two of them. Are you kidding me? <laughs> the zombies, no.
Oh, let's push up this way. Oh, it's over. Dang. This thing actually melts pretty pretty nicely. It uh, it has a really fast time to kill. So I'm going to say it's a big dub so far. i got to get the heck away from there real quick. No. Bruh. <laughs> Man, I am facing some movement sweats today. Rick, Rick James, Rick Rhymes. <laughs> Brother, sheesh, he knew exactly who he was going for. <laughs> this boat is just too funny, dude. <laughs> Wow. Yo. Okay, UAV counter UAV. Here we go. Bruh. 
bro. Anyways, this thing's actually kind of nice. I like it. I think it's a pretty good blueprint, uh, and it's a fun weapon. It fires quick. The time to kill's decent. Um, so I'd say a fun weapon to get. With that said, hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, drop a like. If you're new, make sure to subscribe and notifications on so you don't miss a single upload. And if you want to support the channel directly, you can do so by checking out my sponsors, Control Freaking Name Controller. I use them every single time I play. Photo GX just gets you a discount link down below to that or through my Amazon influencer page if you guys would much rather do it that way. Uh, and then if you guys want to talk and interact, at OGXers over on Twitter, give me a follow over there. Y'all have an awesome day. Take care. I'm out. Peace.